How's it going, Internet? Welcome back to another episode of Yub Plays. Alright, so on a stream recently, I said that if anybody actually bought me a game on Steam, I would play it on YouTube. And so my friend Jesse took it upon himself to find the weirdest freaking game that he could, and <laughs> he bought it for me. It's called Hatful Boyfriend. It's a dating simulator of pigeons. You might have seen it around before. Not something I would have picked to play on my own, but I'm a man of my word. So without further ado, here's Hatful Boyfriend. Let's watch. Is Yub Wiener okay? No. It's not. Yub. Yub Yubbington. Oh, it's not. You can't. You can't do that. Yub Yubbers. Yub Yubbers on the scene. Is Yub Yubbers okay? He sure is. Hatful Boyfriend includes a powerful visualization module, allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal humans when first introduced. Display human portraits? I already have to choose? Uh. Yeah. I guess. Configuration saved. Did I want to do that? St. Pigeonations, a school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through those gates. I should probably say, this school is known for one thing in particular. This school is Japan's, no, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. It's like X-Men, X-Birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports all come to St. Pigeonations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a di uh, God dang it! The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I'm often asked why I chose to come here, despite not being a bird. It's a long story. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. <laughs> oh, the bell already? Come on, we need to hurry to class. Jeepers! <laughs> no good being late on the first day! And so, Ryuta pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust the atmosphere last year. Better make up for all that lost fun! What? Hatful Boyfriend. The most splendid and greatest academy of the Pigeon, by the Pigeon, and for the Pigeon. First term. I think we're in 2-3. Ryuta and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces, a strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. How do the birds have desks? I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of many happy memories. Oh, the teacher's here. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Are you a man or a woman? Uh, I'm Nanakai Kazu... Kaz Kazukai, Kazuki. I'm Nanakai Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. I specialize in math and physics and also some other things. He fell asleep. Sir, wake up! It's homeroom! He sleeps with his eyes open? That's our teacher? Everyone looks like a girl. Yub, are you gonna have to say no homo? I won't say it at all. Gigantic Mark, is this going on YouTube? I think so. I don't know, it depends on how funny it is. This quail is Nanakai Kazuaki. He's a famously sup... Suporific math prof... What is that word? Math professor. I'd heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Apparently, he's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show, great minds come in all forms, including girls that are boys. Ah, I'm sorry. Isn't it a little warm in here? <laughs> Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please introduce yourself, Shirogane. Shirogane? Ooh. What is the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. Oh, well, I guess that's that. Hey, hey, hey! That's no good! Those fade-in animations are a bit much. But- Oh, wait, that one's a guy, too. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. We can't just let him break the rules like that, sir! 
the system will collapse and we'll all turn into kulaks and dissenters. Oh my gosh. Well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shirogane? I'm just moving their voices around at will. Sorry. Shirogane, le belle Sakuya. Hmm. These are all guys. Where's the ladybirds at? I want some ladybirds. It seems that this fantail is Shirogane Sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Sakuya sits down, glaring daggers at Ryuta and me. Ryuta and I. I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Bird fight. Lunch already. Today is slipping by so quickly. I'm going to save because I'm nervous. I'm going to save crawl my way through this game. That reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. You're going to have a mean fee, bro. Where is everyone? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly any birdie here. Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Please be a girl. Or not. A morning dove stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. Is it a goth bird? Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. Uh, did you want something from me? <gasps> he looked away. They're all boys! That's fine. Not really. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes. I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk as if to say, hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they were a little too dense and I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? Hmm. He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood. I'm Yubber's Yub. What? Oh, I forgot. Backwards names in Japan, whatever. I'm Yubber's Yub, a sophomore. What about you? Mm. Y you're... Mm. Nageki. Fujishiru. Nageki. Freshman. Let's see what this bad boy looks like. You are a girl! Fujishiro Nageki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. He's just goth. Leave me alone. He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. Save my game. Can I please meet a girl bird? I keep meeting depressing people today. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that... Uh-oh. You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sakuya. What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother? After all these years? My brother? You must be joking. You never once been a brother to me. Please, don't try to talk to me again. I've got no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Hey, wait just a... I guess even if we're in the same school now, what's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. The ever popular trendsetter and ladies man, Sakaza Yu. Sak Sakazaki? <laughs> That's not really it, is it? Sakazaki Yuya is Sakuya's brother? I wonder what the story is behind that. Hey. <gasps> you heard that whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? I I'm, I'm sorry! I didn't mean to listen in on you! Yes, you did. Haha, <laughs> no sweat. I try to stay sexy and suave in front of all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. I'm a girl! Oh! I'm a girl. Okay, I'm gonna save since now I understand. Now we have to pick the best boys. Okay, now I can get behind this. All right, guys, I had to end that video right there. I thought that was a good spot to end it since I just figured out that I'm a girl. I'm a human girl in a school full of birds, and I get my pick. 
I'm gonna pick the best bird of them all. So thanks so much for watching this video. Come back for the next one. And as always, have a bye five.